Hey guys, Vizerlo Productions here, and welcome to a a video that I'm gonna start doing a lot. So Nintendo just finished their uh, as I'm recording this, they just recently finished their uh, direct for today, and I'm gonna be going over the direct and the big stuff. So that's really all I have to say. So uh, yeah, all right, start. So from the top, uh. So the first thing you'll notice from the thumbnail of the direct is that it's focused on Splatoon 2 and ARMS. Yeah, I think we know um, which one's more popular. So basically then, um, they start off the eShop with a bunch of, um, or not the, they start off the direct with a bunch of 3DS stuff. And personally, I don't play my 3DS anymore. I really don't. I don't care that much for it. But there's a few titles I am kind of interested in. Um, one of them trumps them all, or triumphs them all, sorry, uh, let's not talk about that. So, um, basically, um, the first thing they have to mention is that, um, I'm just gonna be going over the things that only caught my eye, so, uh, yeah. You, uh, what's it, how's it pronounced again? Yokai, you, yo, yukai, I know lots of people pronounce it yokai, but I just always thought it was, like, yukai, I don't know why, I just... I, like, I just heard heard it one day and was like, oh, Yokai. So, Yokai 2 is, um, is a game coming out. I don't remember, like, Shadow something. It's completely unscripted, by the way. So, it's like, I've never played the original. I know it's popular. A lot of the em um, elements seem like they're just taking them from Pokemon. I mean, like, um, you can tell, you can see the mystery dungeon elements and, like, yeah, it's, um, it has a lot of Pokemon elements. I'm not interested, but um, yeah, so everything else um, on the 3DS didn't catch us for two other things. Um, so there was a Kirby 25th Anniversary Special. They're coming out with a Super Smash Brothers-like game all about Kirby's, which I thought was kind of weird at first, but it's actually available right now and it's free, so that's, that's a lot better than I thought and I might actually get it. Um, and uh, besides that, they said that they or they teased, they haven't shown any gameplay, but they just teased that they're coming out with a new Kirby game for December. It's going to be big. Oh, Christmas, blah. And then they're, um, they, they have like um, another game, which I don't really care that much about. I don't really care that, believe it that much for the uh, Kirby series. I know lots of people do, but it's just not really my thing. I've never really played it though, so I guess it kind of explains it. But the thing that I'm most surprised about is that there's a game coming out called RPG Maker FES for the Nintendo 3DS. And when I heard of this game, I was blown away that it was RPG Maker on a console. So, on a portable console. So, I have um, MV and um, VX Ace. And, like, those are phenomenal game developing tools and they're coming to the um the nintendo eShop for 3ds if they made one for the switch i would be entirely sold i don't know if i'm gonna buy it still really interested in that i can't rpg maker wow so that's kind of the only things that are really interesting for the 3ds part of course if you want to check out the direct you'll be in the description below and um, next is the um, next is the switch. So they kick it off with arms. I'm not interested in arms. I've kind of changed my mind on it. I was gonna make a video on that. That'll be coming up soon about me changing my mind on arms because I originally really hated the idea. Um, but I think now it's it's pretty much melted into my brain that I don't want arms. The narrator doesn't cat isn't really that something that I care about. They have a narrator for the gameplay. They also have, um, they also unveiled some new stuff that's gonna be really cool, like, um, I don't remember, Min Min, I think it was? Min Min. Okay, that's a thing. Besides that, like, arms, I don't care about it. I, it just synced into my brain how much I don't care about arms. There's so many other things that I'm looking forward to, but yeah. Arms isn't one of them, so they stretch arms for like ten minutes. I wanted to skip most of it because I wasn't interested in it, and um, that's kind of it for arms, really. Um, the thing that I, I um, that next we have is 
for the Nintendo Switch. And what do we have? Well, not that many titles that caught my eye, but there's a couple that I'd like to mention. Uh, some of them, the first one I'd like to mention is Puyo Puyo Tetris. I'm gonna be actually doing a, um, um, a live stream of that, so if you wanna see me play Puyo Puyo Tet Tetris demo, uh, then you can do that. Um, it'll be on Sonic Kaboom. I might, actually I might put it on Bazillo Productions, I don't know. Uh, so Puyo Puyo Tetris! Oh, your buddy, buddy. I don't really, I don't think I'm gonna buy it, but, eh. Um, there's, uh, there was, um, Minecraft. Believe it or not, I'm actually probably gonna get it because, um, I play, I, um, played Minecraft a lot, and I just thought that, like, you know, but playing, like, the console edition is good. I personally, nowadays, I don't care for the PE edition. And it's literally, like, this is replacing Pocket Edition. So that's probably why I'm gonna get it, because they also have the same thing for the Vita, so. Yeah. Um, is there anything else I'm missing? I don't, I didn't write down barely anything. Um, they also showed off, like, this game. I don't remember what it's called. It's like this puzzle project. Um, really, I, n I never, it, it's, it's like this puzzle kind of thing where you stomp on the ground. Kind of interesting. I'm not gonna get it because it's just, I, I mean, it was, it was kind of interesting, but, uh, I don't know. Um, oh yeah, it reminds me. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Um, it's, it's, I'm getting it. Yeah, I mean, most of the stuff isn't really new stuff. It's just, Look at this, look at this, look at this. Um, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, I already know pretty much everything I have to know about it. Um, there's a new Street Fighter game coming out for the Switch. That's, that's a thing, which I don't, I'm not too interesting, interested about. Um, Sonic Mania and Sonic, uh, Forces. Yeah. Uh, summer release date, that's fine, I'll get it in summer. Um, lots of people have been wondering why I, I'd buy, um, ukulele for the Switch and for the, uh, and for the computer, because I got it for the computer. Reason is just because I really, like, I just really like, um, the style of ukulele, and I play that, and I just want to play it at home and on the go. I know that's what the Switch does, but my PC is just a lot faster, and it's my choice. And that's kind of the. I just think that I want to get it on the computer and the Switch. And, um, yeah, that's my. And probably actually one of the main reasons so I can play it earlier. And a lot, I know a lot of people won't agree with me, but I'm promising you that's my decision. If you have complaints, um, you probably shouldn't. If you have, like, a complaint with my opinion, you, you could leave. You can leave the video. And um, everyone will be happy. Uh, besides that, um, Splatoon 2 is the only other is the really big thing I have to cover next. I was if I didn't want Splatoon 2 as much, I want it now. Mainly because they're having this new salmon salmon mode. It's kind of it's basically Call of Duty Zombies on, and it's wow. If I was that's probably one going to be one of my favorite features. Um, and like, um, they announced a new, a new, uh, Splatoon Amiibos, it's kind of dank, interesting, I don't really, I don't really have that many ami ami uh, Amiibos, I just think that they're kind of like, they don't really, none of them really add that much, um, oh yeah, um, Ubisoft just an, um, announced some other games, like Rayman Legends Deluxe Edition, Never played Rayman. I don't think I'm gonna be interested. Monopoly for the Nintendo Switch. Yeah, I'm not like motion controls. Or well, not really. It's just vibration. You can feel the di you can feel the dice move around. Wow. Not really my thing. It's interesting, but eh, I probably won't buy it. I I don't think so. It's it's uh, I don't know. Um, Shine More, actually, that's like kind of, uh, I, I think it's called Shine More, I don't know how to pronounce it. Kind of like a shooter, um, underwater thing. Interesting. Might get it if it has a cheap price. 
But if it's like really expensive, then no way am I gonna get a shooter for that price. Payday 2, yay. That, um, I don't really care that much for Payday. Um, 2017 is expected. Now here's something interesting, standalone Nintendo Switch dock release date. I was going to get this, but I heard that they're way, way too expensive. $90 and it takes like, what, $33, $27 to make them? Yeah, and also the dock is really cheap. Eh. And, um, of course they announced, uh, Splat the Competition on Wii U. Probably will join that and I'll probably stream it. And, besides that, that's kind of it for, like, my first thoughts on the Direct. Now, of course, please tell me anything I can improve in the comment section below. I know this wasn't the best of quality, but that's because I didn't write anything down. Lots of people prefer, actually, for me not to do scripted videos, so, yeah. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you all later. See you.